Hi guys, today's video is going to be a Vivian Westwood collection video. Now every time I ever mention um, an item of Vivian Westwood clothing or accessories or anything in a video, people ask me to make a video showing my whole collection. And over the years, every time I've showed something, I have just held back from doing a collection video. And that's basically because I don't want it to seem, and I totally understand how it could come across in a braggy way and I think it's the same with any YouTuber who makes I've seen loads of videos with people who talk about like their designer bag collection or their designer clothes collection or whatever 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 or shoes or anything um, and everyone always kind of feels a bit the same like if they're showing on designer things in a collection it's bragging but I wouldn't do this video unless it had been requested and actually I have never ever in my life got all of my Vivian Westwood things in one place together and I've just done it now and I'm, it's quite shocking <laughs> how much um, has accumulated over the past sort of six years I'd say um, and also I just wanted to say that um, most of the things have been gifts probably 90% so what I'm going to do is just go into the video, I'm going to go through in different categories and I hope you enjoy it, um, but please know that it's not a bragging video, it's it's literally a fashion showing video, so I hope that's all cool. I'm going to start with accessories and the first accessory I have to show you is my bag. So I own one Vivian Westwood bag and it was a present for Christmas from Tiz. Now it's in this little dust bag, it says Vivian Westwood. You might have seen this before in a video or an outfit blog thing. So here it is, it's a huge bag, um, it can fit loads in it, it's this like grey and brown snakeskin effect with the golden orb, big handles and this is how it looks when it goes around. So it's absolutely one of my favourite items ever, um, I keep it really safe, I keep it in its dust bag, I don't use it very often because I'm really scared of like anything happening to it at all but I need to use it a bit more often because I always think it's a shame not to use something ever just because you're worried but I adore this. If I look like I've changed positions it's because I just had to run and get something that I'd forgotten about and that reason I'd forgotten about it is because it's something I use every day so it's an everyday item and somehow it's developed the opposite philosophy to my bag and this is a purse it was a birthday present from my mum it's um it's a Hollywood design purse it has this black glittery effect with a little orb on the front here and unlike the bag which I don't use very often because I don't want to risk sort of using it too much or damaging it or anything like that I actually use this every day and it's silly really because I don't know why I don't use the bag more often I need to sort my little brain out about that one but I love this this is from my mum I have used it every day since I got it and it's an ultimate favourite. Sticking with accessories I have two scarves to show you the first one um, was a gift from my grandma. Now it's a little um, square when it's all open you can see all the orbs and then you kind of fold it into a triangle like so, be like a blue Peter presenter and um, it has um, an actual orb stitched onto the front here so it's a proper stitched one and um, this is interesting um, these scarves now retail for like 60 70 pounds it's crazy but when i got this um we'd been into the vivian westwood shop that used to be in the trafford center in manchester to get something i'm going to show you in a minute which was my 18th birthday present and when we were in the shop well, my grandma was with me and my mum and we saw this scarf and my grandma said would you like that scarf for your birthday and it was 15 pounds 15 not 50 15 and so because we were like oh these scarves are really reasonably priced me my mum my auntie my grandma my sister all got one um of different designs because we were like 15 pounds for Vivian Westwood scarf that's amazing and now they're like 60 so we don't really know what happened with these but I love this one and then my other scarf was a birthday present from my mum one year it's just a black tassel scarf with the Vivian Westwood in um silver on the front there and it's a really warm snug scarf as opposed to this one which is like a fashion scarf this is a really warm snuggly one next up you might remember these from a, a recent ish video these are my vivian westwood gloves they have a little orbs on the side here and on the other one as well i bought these myself with money that i was given from relatives and friends for my birthday last year 
um, and Christmas too. I kind of put it all together and bought myself some really nice gloves. So I'm a huge fan of these. They're really, really comfy. My fingers go really funny in like cotton gloves that makes me cringe. So these are a perfect um, alternative. Okay, I'm going to move on to jewellery. Now I have these three boxes here. And then I have these two little cubed thingies. So um, this is how everything started. So on my for my 18th birthday, my mum said, you know, would, is there anything that you would like that you can keep forever that's like a traditional sort of thing as in like jewellery? And I said, well, I love Vivian Westwood and I don't have anything of hers at the time. So would it be possible to look for a Vivian Westwood ring? So we found the ring and I'll show you. It's in its little thing here. So this is the ring, I'll do a little close up for you. It's a pink heart and it's in the orb shape and it has little diamondy things around and it's just this beautiful, beautiful thing. It's my special 18th birthday present that I love and adore and this is what started everything, this little cheeky ring. So then, as the story goes, um, Tiz, this, my 18th birthday was the first year that Tiz and I were together. So we'd been together about six months and he wanted to get me a special present for my 18th. So he was talking to my mum and she told him about my Vivian Westwood thing. And he got me, in this little box, this lovely necklace and it is stunning. It's a long, long-ish necklace and it's this black heart and it's got the orb on the heart and then these little stars all around. So it's like my perfect thing, it's heart, stars black, silver, Vivian Westwood. I adore it. It's one of my favourite things of all time. It has stars just on the back um, and it's incredibly, incredibly special to me as well. So I love this. It's my, probably my favourite necklace in the whole world. Okay, so here's where the plot thickens. So my birthday is in December. It's the 5th of December, so it's only 20 days away from Christmas. So this whole Vivian Westwood obsession was kind of really known at this time and um, my mum for Christmas very very generously got me a necklace to match my uh, ring so it's this red orb and um, it's the same as my necklace but it's the the, uh, the the sorry it's the same as my ring but it's the necklace version and um, the heart itself is slightly less shiny than the the ring but it's still the exact same design, so I was incredibly chuffed with that and I thought it was really, really kind. And then the plot thickens even further because <laughs> Tiz, Tiz is, he's the loveliest person in the world and what he does is we agree something and then he goes and does something 10 times better. So we'll agree a budget for Christmas and birthday and then he'll go off and spend more than we'd ever agreed which is exactly what happened with the bag and exactly what happened with another item and exactly what happened with this <laughs> so he very very kindly got me the matching bracelet to the ring and the necklace for my 18th year Christmas um, and it was so sweet and lovely and he's just lovely <laughs> um, but again I was just overwhelmed with how generous everybody was like around that time and it was lovely and I'm so grateful Okay, last jewellery item, um, these were a gift from Tiz's sister and her husband and they are, believe it or not, the matching earrings to my black and silver necklace and these were a present for my 21st birthday um, they are stunning, I don't know how they managed to find, their, oh by the way they're hoops, they're hoops um, I don't know how they managed to find the ones that matched my necklace but somehow they did and I adore them Okay, I'll do shoes next. I have three pairs of Vivian Westwood shoes and they're all the Melissa ones. So they're not um, as expensive as the actual Vivian Westwood shoes, which can be like £500 a pair. So I'm going to start with these ones. These are little um, wedges and they are cut out at the back. And I actually bought these from the website Brand Alley, which is like um, an outlet discount place. So they get surplus stock of things and they sell it off. So I got these for about £40, which is amazing. Vivian Westwood, Melissa little cross front wedge shoes. Um, I haven't worn them that many times because they're not super comfortable, but they're really good for like a barbecue or something. You know where you're like, if it's like a big family barbecue and you're kind of in and out of the house and you're just kind of sitting down. They're really good for that. So those are the first pair. 
Now the second pair are a pair of the flats and they have a big bow on the front. Unfortunately one of the bows fell off so they're currently at Tiz's mum's house and she's fixing them for me. But I do have a pair to show you here which I might have shown you in a recent video. These were um, a birthday present from my mum uh, on my last birthday and they are these gorgeous um, felt buckle shoes. They have the little orb on the side. Um, I've only worn them a couple of times because uh, if it's ever raining I can't really wear them because they're felt. So I love them. They remind me of like um, historical times and I feel really cute when I'm wearing them like a Georgian. Okay I have two perfumes to show you. I love the Vivian Westwell perfumes. Um, this one was one that Tiz bought me when we were first going out. Um, it's actually the second bottle. Um, we would actually we might have been together about a year. Uh, I can't remember, I think it might have been maybe Valentine's Day or an anniversary. And then you got me this. Um, it's the Let It Rock, they don't make it anymore but it just reminds me of Christmas time. So if I smell it, it just takes me to Christmas time and that is what, that is my Christmas fragrance. And then the other one I have here is Sunny Alice, it's one of the new Vivian Westwood fragrances and this is a gift from my lovely friend and it's the perfect summer scent. Oh, it's lovely. All of the Vivian Westwood perfumes are just delicious and divine in every way. So, absolutely adore this one. Um, I've had a couple of other Vivian Westwood ones. I've had another one for Let It Rock, and then I had Cheeky Alice as well, which was a present from my grandparents. Um, but I've used that one up because it's amazing. Okay, what's well, the last thing, and it's a biggie. So, you know I was telling you about how Tiz goes overboard, and it's in the loveliest way possible. Well, we had agreed a budget for Christmas, the one just gone, and we were like, we were not going to go over that budget, absolutely no way, and Tiz got me some really nice presents and I was absolutely thrilled with them, and then he brought out this extra present and I was just flabbergasted, because I had loved everything he'd already got me and I thought it was wonderful, and then he surprised me with this jumper dress, now it's huge. It's an oversized jumper dress. It has the big gold orb on the front here. It's this amazing like stone wash. I'm sorry, this uh, my hair, I just molt. So this all these little, sorry, sorry it's gross. Um, it's like this stone washed sort of, I mean I don't even know, like navy, um, burnt sort of greys, also there's so many colours in this, it's amazing. So when he gave me that I was so speechless, I just didn't know what to say and I was so chuffed, so amazing. And that is my Vivian Westwood collection, I really hope you've enjoyed this video and that you don't think it's braggy or anything like that, I love telling stories behind special items and these are all really 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 special to me so I hope you've enjoyed and um, don't forget to subscribe for more videos, there's a button just below. Um, feel free to follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Tumblr, everywhere. I'll put links below. Um, thank you again for watching, guys, and I'll see you soon. Bye.